Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. Now we are here in our Dev C++ and now we're going to demonstrate the midterm examinations or examination. <laughs> yes. Ayan, so, ayan po. Ito yung ating um, structure. So, for the variables, we have uh, int and double. So, for the int, uh, quiz, assignment, uh, behaviors, and lectures. Then, second line is the machine problem and the laboratories. So, this line is includes here, which is the lecture grade inputs. And, uh, the second N is the machine problem and the laboratories, which is included here in the laboratory grade input. Then, lastly, uh, yung pinaka output natin, which is the totals or the total grade for lecture, laboratory, and the subject grade, which is um, connected dito sa ating mga formula. So, uh, first, uh, mag input tayo ng uh, quiz, assignments, behavior, and lecture. Then, second is input the machine problem and the laboratories. After that, uh, automatic na magko-compute yung ating total grades for the lecture, laboratory, and the subject grade. So, formula nila is yung dito. So, yung total lecture is ito yung formula niya. Ito. So, included yan. Ito, yung quiz assignment, behavior, and lectures. Then, for the laboratories is uh, ito yung formula niya, which is the machine problem and the laboratory. So, ito yun. Dito siya nagaling. Then, lastly, uh, computation ng, ano, ng subject grade is ito. The lecture grade and the lab laboratory grade. Then, for our ano, uh, equivalent grade and the description is depending on the subject grade. So, dito po siya nagbe-base. Then, if and else natin. Yan, so... Meron tayong ranging, yeah, 96 to 100, and so forth. And lastly, is the else, which is the 95, which failed. So, uh, dito sa, sa pinakauna is 96 to 100 is excellent for the description and equivalent grade is 1.00. So, now let's run the program to see the output. And so, kung nakikita nyo ngayon, yan. So, kung nakikita nyo po ngayon, uh, yung ating, ay, wait na, ulitin natin. Yan. yan. So, kung nakikita nyo po ngayon, yung ating uh, output is here. So, lecture grade, Meron po tayo dito mga uh, sample it inputs, which is the A, B, C, D, and E. So, first, the uh, letter A. So, input may 84, 90, 73, 98, 85, and 95. And so, let's check if the output is correct. So, total lecture is 89.7, 89, then 89.28. Then, evaluation or equivalent grade is 1.75. Then, good. So, okay na po yung ating A. Then, next is... Next is the letter B. So, so letter B naman po is... Ito yung mga inputs natin. 87... Ay! 97, 98, 95, 90, 95, and 90. And so, let's check if tama yung total grades natin for the output. 94.2, 93, 93.48. And the equivalent is 1.25, then superior. So, tama. Next, proceed. Let's proceed to, to the letter C, which is 80, 81, 82, 85, 85 and 80. So, the output is 
82.4, then the equivalent is 2.25 and the average for the description. Then next, let's proceed for the letter D. So, for the letter D is 79, 80, 78, 79, 80, and 80. So, the output is 79.1, 80, 79.64, then 2.50, then pass for description. Then, lastly, let's proceed for the letter E which is 71, 72, 73, 74, 70, 72. Then the output is 72.6, 70.8, and lastly is the equivalent and description 5, then failed. So that's all. Thank you for watching.